Mark and I went to college, University of Texas, and we started talking about we wanted wings delivered late night one night, and we couldn't find any wings. And in the South where we grew up, there was wings everywhere. So we decided in college that we were gonna open a wing restaurant. Mark and I worked on the idea until our junior year, senior year, and we decided this is what we're gonna do and open a Pluckers. We tested on friends and family at our chili cook-off. Sean was, Sean was three years younger than us and helped us cook all the wings. And we opened Pluckers the first day, about two weeks after graduated college on July 23rd, 1995, at a little, little shack right next to our dorm. It was originally 1,300 square feet, or 1,100 square feet, sorry. That was same. West Campus, Rio Grande, really more or less in the same location it's in today, except half a block down. We didn't know anything about marketing. We didn't know anything about accounting. We didn't know anything about management. Mark and I just sort of had like a dream to operate a primarily takeout and delivery wing restaurant. We had a, when we opened, we had a dining room. It you just was 13 or 15 seats. Both Dave and I were in the restaurant all hours of every day. There was many a night where Dave or I was the actual driver and cook, or waiter and cook. In any one given shift, the person cooking might also be the person delivering the food. Well, that makes the cooking hard when you're out on the deliveries. The very first day we opened the store, we ran out of chicken wings. I, I went out and was flyering. I come back and, and Mark and Dave are like, oh my God, you know, we just ran a 23 minute ticket time on the first chicken sandwich we served. We hadn't gotten out of the kitchen. I don't think they got out of the kitchen for another four years. <laughs> <laughs> Mark, Sean and I have gotten to know the staff so well. And that was the advantage of actually being in the restaurants every single day, be able to have them understand the vision that we had for Pluckers. We have 10 people on staff who've been with us at least 15 years and they've never wanted to leave. We've always had a passionate guest following. You could feel the transition happening where people were excited to come to Pluckers. They wanted to hang out at Pluckers. So our passion, besides Pluckers, is sports, all three of us. Having the TVs and watching sports and adding the bar all became pretty simple additions. It was a lot of fun and obviously a lot of hard work. The three of us all share an unwillingness to quit, and each of us was going to prove to the other that they had what it takes. And you know, it's, it's like, I'm not quitting, are you quitting? <laughs> that kind of thing. So. We made sure that no matter what went into the business, no one was gonna outwork us, no one was gonna be friendlier to the guests, no one was gonna be more apologetic to people we made mistakes. Pluckers is an experience. It's where people go to have fun. Yeah, it's hospitality, right? A lot of celebrations and a lot of joy is around the dinner table. So for us, we wanna make that special and always have. It.